successfully breached the Great Wall of China. He led his forces to the greatest prize in the East, the capital city of Zhongdu. He besieged the city, knowing that its inhabitants could not hold out forever. Bearing down on the gleaming capital of Zhongdu, Genghis Khan raised the black banner of war on his historic enemy, the Qin Dynasty. To take the heavily garrisoned capital, the Mongols would have to starve its army by eliminating Chengdu's suppliers. But first, the Khan directed his warriors to raid Qin buildings and villages surrounding Chengdu. Word of the army's wealth would spread, compelling Mongol soldiers from the north to join the fight, seeking spoils of their own. successful raids, Mongol settlers and soldiers arrived to join his army. With his numbers steadily growing, the Khan turned his attention to the capital. He sought to starve Chengdu's army by cutting off its suppliers.
Nos millions d'entre nous, t'es. A Chin trader made it safely into the city and reported on the Mongols' numbers and movements. Chengdu would now allocate any military supplies it received to rallying counterattacks on the steppe invaders. The Mongols left the Shunyi market in ruins, 
ensuring the village could no longer send supplies to Chengdu. In destroying the supplying markets, the Mongols denied Chengdu critical supplies, leaving its garrison weakened. Despite the Mongols' efforts to stop them, enough Qin traders had entered Chengdu to fully resupply its military. Choosing their moment, the Qin launched a counterattack. The Mongols put down the Qin counterattack, but another would soon come if Qin traders continued to resupply Chengdu's military.
Genghis Khan's army struck down the trader that was headed to resupply Chengdu. For every trader killed, Chengdu lost several days' worth of supplies. The Mongols were systematically choking the city and starving its garrison. efforts to stop them. Enough Qin traders had entered Chengdu to fully resupply its military. Choosing their moment, the Qin launched a counterattack. The market at Tongzhou was set aflame, and with it many vital supplies intended for the city. As the Mongols continued to sabotage the city's supplies, Chengdu's garrison grew weaker by the day. And you hear it, boy? Oh, 
гарам билэн эхэлж байна. Мано арилжааны газар билэн. Амар байна уу? Харамж Ажилд билэн. Би жүхэд байна юм. Яд юугаа акс. Орх уу удаар нам дуугаа бол. Яд турх гуд өтэрмэл. Их бой. Би ирж байсу. Амар байна уу? Цугаар билт. Гэшүү тэмгэж бой буюу. Танд юу хэрэгт бой? Жарлаг боолгод хон. Жарлаг болгад хон. Мано арилжааны газар билэн. Уугал арна билэт хон. Мано арилжааны газар болгад. Уугал аран энд байнам. Амар байна уу? 
Гэж итгээд байсан уу? Уугаад арда. Жардиг ирчихвэ. Амир. Хий нэм. Утарг. Despite the Mongols' efforts to stop them, enough Qin traders had entered Chengdu to fully resupply its military. Choosing their moment, the Qin launched a counterattack. Without hesitation, the Khan's warriors put their torches to the market at Daxing, snuffing out weeks of Chengdu's supplies. Ай, чё, хочешь пойдём? Ты уник 
Tady to vše.
Jarlag boolgad khon. Ajig tuhrej bainam. Gurooj bainam. Amar bainu. Daru maghan ab yung hiig boi. Gurooj bainam saan bain. Ажилд билэн, гэшүү тэмгэр анд юүн хэрэгт бэй? Би үлэнчээ байна, би энд байна. Би үүнэг бараа бүгсэу. Юм юм бол хэнүүдэй. Жарлгийг дагаж байна. Юн хийх бой. Юн хийх бой. Гэшү тэмгэж бой бой. Хөдөлгөө я бэлэн. Баныг харуулж байна юм. Би ирж байсан. Ажилд бэлэн. Чад юу ба? Ам дуга дэн бог тур. Тэнд юу хэрэгт бэ? Энд юн хэрэгт бүй, а жэлд бэлэн. Юн хэх бүй. Би үүнэг бараад үхсу. Юн хэх бүй. Түүнэг барсу. Ажил хүлээж байна м? Би гэшү авчирсон. Та юм айлтахгүй. Уугал арам билэн эртгэж байна м? Мануу арилжааны газар билэн. Амар байна уу? Би үнэг байрад үхсу. Юүн хийх бүй.
Gurul Chwanam, a jilt building. Did you take it away so? Jared, you bought that thing. Then the young Eric the boy. Do you like that so? Ta, young Eric the Jared bought that thing. Young Eric boy, did you take it away so? I'm a robot. Big issue, sir. So, Jared, you bought that thing. Oh, what are you? In the bed, man. No, Eric, change the answer. Ah, 
Sugar, some carried the garb of so. Your sort of so. Good. You may have a whole bunch of them. Get into it. I'll not. Yat of him, we put it. Pasta, it could be joined. Oh, 
In raising the market at Fangshen, the Mongols had severed a critical supply line to the capital. With Chengdu devastated by starvation, the walls of the great Qin capital were devoid of soldiers, and only a diminished garrison remained. Desperate and isolated, Zhongdu could no longer resist. The time had come for Genghis Khan to launch his assault on the city. Get in the 
ボードとかおおはいしかもはいですえいパスおこうつぶっジェッティガールポッツォソガールサグルタツコはいはいマナージャリヨッサールマナーソーマナーボクリボトマナーヘッドヨーヒューシュトマルトルカキチャリティクジャイナムヤサルボドクソヨミヨモトヘルテアツタベッドキクジャイナムサナルジャテクソジェンドバイトダニエおいトルコだギャルギッギャルギッタガチワイトビーベニギャルギアサルマッソジャルギレドガハンハンマナージャリティグボードとはジャリティグレードがハンコブジャリティサドルとトマリカルズワイルハンサーのセットルジェンギス・カーン、unleashed the wrath of his Mongol warriors on the heart of the beleaguered city. Oh, I think so. 
Chin monument was put to flame. Mongol victory was within reach. The city was ready to fall in the wake of the destruction wrought by the Mongols. Zhongdu fell to the wrath of Genghis Khan's warriors, yielding great riches for the Mongol Empire. The sacking of Zhongdu would be remembered as one of Genghis Khan's most devastating victories. But this was just the beginning of his quest to create a global empire under Mongol rule. <laughs> 